tap here. Sorry about that brief hyenas, but evidently somebody called my parole officer and told him I was drinking beer and sent him a video for proof. And long story short, I wound up being in a clink for a little while. But thank God for that public defender knowing what the Constitution is, because until they can prove that this is a non-tampered with bottle and it does indeed contain alcohol, they can't prove I was drinking. Can't get a breathalyzer off a of video. Ha ha ha! Mm. America, celebrate my recent release from incarceration. I got this here, Rye on Rye, 2015. Now, as you may notice, we're also inside the trailer because it has gotten a little cold outside since I was locked away for about a month and a half. So we're going to go ahead and pop this baby open and get ready to have some fun. This is kind of fancy. It comes with a Kirk. I thought Kirk's were only for that high-end champagne. I know... I've had some wine in my day, but it all had screw off tops like Mad Dog and Night Train and shit like that. Mm. So let's see what happens when we pop this open. It's got a Kirk in it right here. Ainsy. Here we go. We're going to pop that Kirk. That was kind of anticlimactic. All right. We're going to pour that beer right there in that. Mm. Right there. All right. Now. Rye on rye, ale aged in rye whiskey barrels. Mmm, let's see how she tastes. She purrs real pretty. Maybe she's gonna smell pretty. Mmm, she smells it. Smell her. Mmm, how she smell. All right, here we go. Yeah, that's some beer you can chew right there. Got a little bit of that whiskey flavor to it. I like that there whiskey. Mmm, mmm, looks kind of like, looks kind of like poopy, but it tastes pretty dang good. Mmm, you know, this got to be made in America, and better yet, it's made in Missouri. Greatest state in the whole damn union, Missouri, America. All right, I'm going to go purr this out. Enjoy it.